uh, personally the first time i realized that uh, you know something was happening in arunachal was when as a young uh, you know woman in college i learned about the asmis uh, book uh, written by lep lumar dai pai lumar as we used to call him a konyar mulyo but that was in asmis and i had an handicap i didn't know how to read and write asmis but uh, again uh, later we came to know about uh, our vaidhi thongchi sir's writings again in asmis so i haven't had the opportunity to read the asmis script, you know uh, right on uh, padmashri madam mamang dai her pen you know uh, english writings poetry and you know novels so things have been looking up and now on the social media we are getting to see lots of creative writings taking place you know uh, instant poetry and uh, some snippets of uh, daily happening so it seems uh, you know we are getting to uh, read lots of uh, writings but in terms of organized publications and all uh, nothing much is really happening like you know in if we look at nagaland or mizoram or even meghalaya and of course assam uh, they have a whole kind of you know heritage of literature uh, literature is something which is not just creative but also uh, record uh, you know a documentation of uh, what's happening in the society what people are going through their hopes and aspirations and also their uh, problems their uh, trials and tribulations they are going through and after a certain age after a certain period of time uh, those are going to be reflections history uh, of the state and its people so literature is uh, growing and uh, its the scope is uh, quite far and wide it's wonderful it's high time in fact uh, uh, some people might say it's past time but uh, it's good it's never too late to start and this is a wonderful beginning i personally see forward like you know maybe uh, 10 years hence when i'm absolutely retired from active social life also this will give us time to reflect on to you know to uh, kind of enjoy once in a while so great i look forward thank you